All right, so somebody's challenged me to start with square roots, so I'm gonna do that today. So our total is 11. I'm gonna do 12 minus four plus three. One is the square root of one, two is the square root of four, four is the square root of 16, and three is the square root of nine. Okay, so we are adding a single digit at the end, so the, whatever happens at the beginning here, we need to be between two and 10, essentially. We have to have a one. Now, we're, we could be adding one at the end if we divide to end up at 10. That's possible. We could do like 20 divided by two plus one, but I don't really want to repeat the two right now if I don't have to. Otherwise, the one is gonna have to be the, the ones digit of the two digit number here, because I'm pretty sure it's two digit divided by a one digit. And it can't be 30 or 40, so we could do like 51, but then you're gonna have to divide by three, I think. 61. I think might even be prime. 71 might be prime. I'm not sure on those two. 81, we could divide by nine and then add two. Ooh, that's actually not too bad because that gives us the two over here. I, I might do that. 81 divided by nine plus two. That lets us check some more digits, the eight and the nine. Let's try that. There we go. All right, and that was it, cool. And yeah, a lot of times it feels like uh, you know, you're trying different things and you can't come up with anything that works. Well, that's because the only thing that works is the right answer. So, um, like I said, 20 divided by 2 would have worked too, but um, it wouldn't have had as many unique digits. So that wouldn't have been as good to try. So, let me know what your approach to today's Mathler was and be sure to subscribe for more puzzles.